This is Code.org. I'm currently working on their CS Fundamentals course. I'm on the lesson For Loops with B, Puzzle 8. The last number in your, in your for loop is called the increment. Each time the loop is run, the number variable changes by the value of the increment. Yes, it's incremented. So we, when it's count by, I'm going to just pull it out. I wish they had shown. Count by, this is what they mean by increment. And that sounds like a fancy word. It kind of is. But what they mean is this. That's how much the number changes each time. The counter variable changes by the value of increment. Yes. And it doesn't have to be one. It just tells them the variable what to count by. Try collecting these flowers using an increment of two. Okay. So it wants us to change that to two. Now bear in mind, if I do that, and counter is set to 1 at first and goes to 10, how many times will my loop run? Well, if I start at 1, um, uh, let's start at 2. It will just be kind of easier for us. How many times will it run? Well, I'm starting at 2. I'll run through this. And then, here, let's do an action like move forward. I'll show you. So, it starts at 2. Then it's 4. Then it's 6. Then it's 8. Then it's 10. So, it's not going to move forward uh, 10 times, it's only going to move forward every two. So two, four, six, eight, ten. And once it's ten, you're done. So it's just increasing by two instead of one. So you're not going to move forward actually ten times. All right, let's reset this. They want us to increment by two. Okay, how much is the first one though? So this first one's a one. So we know we want to start with one. So let's c take counter and set it to be equal to 1, and then what do we want to end at? Well, we want to end at 7, so I'm going to put a 7 here. So we want to count from 1 to 7, and what do we want to do? Well, we want to move forward, and then like we have been doing, let's loop. We want to use counter to pick up the nectar. So let's use variable, counter, okay? Repeat counter times, do, and what do we want to do? Get nectar. So the first time counter runs, counter is a 1. And so we'll move forward. One time we'll repeat, get nectar. Now we're going to hit this. Counter is from is a 1, but we're count. Oops. Let's retry. <laughs> I messed up. I should have that as a 2. Counter's 1. And we'll collect. Yep. Now we're going to make counter, which was 1, equal to count by 2. So counter 1 plus 2 is 3. So I'll move forward once. But ah, and now repeat three times. Get nectar, get nectar, get nectar. Once, twice, three times. Then counter is now three. Three, we're counting up by two, plus two is five. So I'll move forward and let's test the whole thing. Ta da! Onward. 